Hi everyone. Welcome to Home Teacher Channel. Home Teacher Channel is an education channel to support all students from grade seven to grade twelve in learning math with more understanding. Lesson for today: System of linear and quadratic equations. System of linear and quadratic equations, Part One of Total Four. System of linear and quadratic equation. To understand the system, we need to understand linear equation. We need to understand quadratic equation. Take a look at Figure One. Y equal to point five x. Plus two. The equation was given. If we put x value minus one, zero, one, we will get y values by substitute x in the equation, and we plot the graph, and then connect the dot by dot, so it will provide a straight line we call linear equation. Take a look at Figure Two. It's a curved line. The equation relates to curved line. We call quadratic equation that has general standard form: y equal to a x square plus b x plus c. Another way to say it is a second degree polynomial equation with a single variable. It means. X square only one variable has square. Take a look at examples. X square minus x minus three. This one is the same as general standard form. Example two. X square minus sixteen. This example b equal to zero. That's why. The remaining is a x square plus c, or x square minus sixteen. For the last example, x square plus seven x, say c equal to zero. That's why it's just only remaining is x square plus seven x. For the figure three, it. Combines between straight line and curved line. This one we will going to discuss in this chapter. We call system of linear and quadratic equation. We are going to find their solution to solve or to find the solution or intercept. We have two methods. First one algebra method, and the second one graphing method. Take a look at the figure. Bangkok Bicentennial Bridge, at Thak Province. It is a parabola arc, which is commonly used in a bridge design. Some student may have question in mind: Why do we need to study parabola? This is a photo. This is a clear evidence that parabola is related to our daily life. Solution to the system by algebra method, step by step, to solve for intercept or to solve for solution of the system of linear and quadratic equation. First one, rearrange it. Second one, make those two equations equal to each other, then simplify. Third one, write it as a quadratic equation. The first one, rearrange it. Just only y stay on the left side, and the remaining stay on the right side. Then, as we take a look at example, we have here. Then we have x square plus x minus two equals minus x 
plus one. Then we eliminate minus x eliminate plus one by plus x then minus one. We do it on this side. On the left side, we also do it. So the remaining is x square plus two x minus three equals to zero. This is as step three. Write it as a quadratic equation. It means that on the left side is the value and variable constant equals zero, zero on the right side, and then we use factoring method. We got x plus three, then x minus one. Because what times what equals minus three? The answer is minus one and plus three. What combined together? Then we have two, so minus one combined with plus three, we obtain two. So. X plus three equals zero, then x equals three. X minus one equals zero, then x equals one. Here comes to the final step. Step four. Replace x value to x value in the linear equation and solve for y. So we put x value equal one. Put x value equal minus three. So we receive y equal to zero. Y equal to four. Y minus one plus one get zero. Y equal to minus minus three. We have plus three combined with one, then we get four. So first pair x and y one zero. Another pair x and y minus three and minus and four. So then we put it in a graph. We draw curve line here. We draw straight line here. Then we put the intercept. As we see in the figure, take a look at geometry shape here. Geometry shapes are on the multitudes of elements and forms that go into Thai architecture. Means to say that geometry shapes is involved in many ways and long, long time ago for our cultural and traditional. Design of Thai house or Thai temples. So for those, the next lesson, lesson two, two point one, part two of total four. Time to go now. Thank you much for watching our for picture channel video. Hope much you enjoy. Get more understanding in mathematics lesson for today. See you next time. Bye bye.